spot on. In fact, I was, I was having a conversation with a friend of mine, probably not more than a couple of weeks ago, on the same subject, specifically on the the way the way we framed it in the conversation was people aren't always ready to hear the solution. So you might, like you said, best intention, you're trying to help, but sometimes people just, they've got a problem and they almost, a concern or a problem or a challenge or an issue, whatever it is, they, they think, like you said, you get made, sometimes they just want to sound off and they almost, they just want the validation of the issue. They don't want it to be fit. They're not there in their journey yet. And actually you just, you do the listening. You, you give them that chance to validate by just putting it out there. And then they will reach out again when they're ready for the solution. And that's where you can help them with it. But actually where you try and give the solution you're almost devalidated, whatever the right word is. You're not giving validation to the issue. You've almost skipped it and you're like, oh no, but it's not a problem because of the, the, the which is probably completely correct, but they, their brain is just looking for that validation and you've almost steered them off of it and they almost try and fight harder to get that validation. And it, it can, you know, you're you're talking about the same thing, but talking about cross purposes. It's really funny. I say we were just talking about it a couple of weeks ago with one of my friends and exactly that same thing. And I say that was similar thing to you said you've the active listening thing is are they looking for a solution or are they looking for validation and you've got to make sure you give the right thing so you don't end up going in that wrong direction like you exactly like you said there